This tutorial is going to teach you how to import video files into your Share Factory using a USB drive. So Share Factory on PS4, what you have to do, we're going to go ahead and open up our USB on the computer. And inside the USB, we're going to create a few folders. Folder number one is going to be a folder called Share Factory. You can see what I'm doing here. So I'm going to go ahead and create new and then I'll click on folder and I'm going to rename this folder that I just created share factory spell it out with s h a r e f a c t o r y inside the share factory folder we're going to create another folder and this one we're going to name videos v i d e O S. I may sound ridiculous when I'm trying to spell these ones out for you guys, but as a matter of fact, it's the where the gist of this video is. If you misspell these, or if you make a simple mistake in these ones, it's not going to work for you. So now you can copy your video and put it inside the video folder. So you have two folders. You have the share factory folder, and inside the share factory folder, you have the videos folder. And inside the videos folder, is where you put your video that you want to import into share factory now we're going to go ahead and eject our usb drive and we will switch over onto the ps4 and i'll show you the more steps that are to come so we're going to go ahead and click here and we're going to go and say eject usb flash drive and you can see i can safely now remove my hardware from the computer so i'm going to go ahead and switch onto the ps4 to show you guys so now we're in the ps4 and we've opened up our share factory we're going to go ahead and say import content on the import content you're going to navigate to import videos and on import videos on the left hand side you have import from usb so import from USB, when you click that, it's going to bring all the videos that you have on your, your USB. You can see our intros right here. We're going to go ahead and select it using the X. And after selecting it using the X button on your controller, you're going to go ahead and import it using the box button on your computer. And you can see because my video is so short, it's only 10 seconds. It has already imported. You can see it here when I say most recent. You can see it. Now what we're going to do, we're going to go ahead and open a Share Factory um, project so I can show you how to add it. So you're going to go ahead and navigate to videos and create new project. Now in the new project, you're going to, you may have to scroll around to look for your video, which are usually on the bottom of the uh, uh, imported videos. So you can see my video is right here. It's the cool intro maker with a bold. It's right here, 10 seconds. So I select it and I select all the other videos that I want to include in my project. For this reason, I'm just going to select the Playroom video, which comes with a PS4 Share Factory. So you can see now I have two of them here. And please go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Uh, so what's going to happen? I'm going to play it for you guys to show you how it worked. This is not my video, this is a video that comes with it, but this is my introduction right now. You can see it. It says let's play and it says subscribe. I just wanted to add anything just to create a video to show you guys. And you can see now I have it in my share factory and I can edit it into my videos or into my other um, projects the way I want. So that's what you gotta do guys. Remember you have to create two folders. One folder called share factory and the other folder inside the share factory folder called videos and in the videos folder is where you put your video that you want to import into share factory and after that you'll be all set guys thank you so much for watching i hope to see you again soon bye bye for now